September 12, 1964, the first public test of a submarine took place in London. This test was conducted on the Thames River for King James I. 1787, American statesman George Mason suggests the addition of a Bill of Rights to the Constitution, modeled on previous state declarations. However, the motion is defeated. 1958, the U.S. Supreme Court orders the all-white Central High School in Little Rock, Arkansas to integrate. 1959, the TV series Bonanza premieres on NBC and it becomes one of the longest-running westerns in broadcast history. 1964, the film that started spaghetti western genre, A Fistful of Dollars, premieres. It stars Clint Eastwood in his first leading role. 1981, The Smurfs, an animated cartoon series by Hanna-Barbera, is first broadcast in North America. 1992, May C. Jemison becomes the first African-American woman to go into space. She was a physician and a mission specialist on the STS-47, which was the 50th space flight of NASA's space shuttle program. It was the space shuttle Endeavour's second flight, during which 190 hours, Dr. Jemison would conduct experiments on weightlessness and motion sickness. 2005. Hong Kong Disneyland opens in Penny's Bay, Lantau Island in Hong Kong. 2011, the National September 11th Memorial and Museum, also known as the 9-11 Memorial and Museum, is a memorial and museum in New York City. It commemorates the September 11, 2001 attacks, which killed 2,977 people, and it also commemorates the 1993 World Trade Center bombing, which killed six people. The memorial is located at the World Trade Center site, the former location of the Twin Towers that were destroyed during the September 11th attacks. These are just a few of the things that have happened today, September the 12th in history. This has been Mr. Scott with Today in History. Thanks for watching.